So, with six races taken care of, we now head on to the other six races as we prepare for the second half here in Old Good California. Tell us what we have to start on the second half. Race number seven will feature our defending champions, Al Haney Jr., the son of the to drive, and Chris Minagos, taking on Vince Dason and Glenn Murray. Best of luck to these two teams on the quest for victory, and we start the race! Alright, so these two teams trying to take a step towards fulfilling their dreams of becoming the next tag team champions at the end of this season. The four child are gonna eat the fruit, and who's gonna have a command on the lead? It looks like our defending champions will have a command on the lead. They are leaving the other team in the dust. As the first superstar to get beat by S, Glamour, as he heads for the water. And number one is getting left behind in the competition. All the way in the back of the pack, fighting for dear life, all alone in last place. As speed bus number two in this race, we may buy the son of the license to drive, Alvin Heaton Jr. And it was like a couple of silver jar going mess. As number two, we'll get the next command as speed bus, but I don't think that didn't help a lot at all. By now, it is Glenn Murray who leads over Al Heaton Jr. and he pauses for more to try again. We passed the one minute mark of this exciting race. And who will get the next command speed bus? It is number eight. Who's trying desperately to get back in this one. But guess who really needs to catch up every now and then? It's number one. Still fighting for your life. But the next speed bus is going to be made by Vince Dason, who leads Amy and Junior left behind in third place. His team is in the lead right now because. Glenn Murray is in the lead, heading into the wall. And here comes Miss Dayson with all his on as the next PS belongs to... Chris Panacos. But I don't think his team will be able to catch up to Vince Dayson or Glenn Murray in a hurry. Vince Dayson should be able to wrap up this race easily as number one finally gets a turn. But I think he's going to need a lot more help than that to stay in the game. Looks like Abaheen Jr. and Chris Monarchos won't have enough distance to catch up to the other team in time. And number one with another speed bus, but that, but that was rather a pity right there. And he retains last place hardly. And this race is a no bottom folks. Vince Mason and Glenn Murray secures the victory over the defending champions, Abaheen Jr. and Chris Monarchos. As Chris Monarchos better the quarters of the speed wrestling race, I think. That makes it a second speed wrestling race, and number one has no hope for surviving whatsoever, as he's all alone in last place. Alright, so Vince Dyson and Grand Murray secure us another victory. That's fine, they did pretty well, and there's more something coming up. Do not go away!